the person who has defeated or surpassed all rivals in the competition. By this definition, one true champion would be Serena Williams. Not only has Serena proved this by her many wins in her tennis career, but also through many aspects of her life. She has gone after her dreams and is more than just a tennis player, as many know her to be. To get where she is today, Serena has had to work hard through family situations, injuries, and publicity, whether it be good or bad. Growing up, Serena was the youngest of five daughters in her family. Serena was under a lot of pressure from her father. She was homeschooled since the age of five, along with her sister Venus. When, her, when Serena was still young, the family moved to Compton, Los Angeles. Her father did this so the kids could see what would happen if they did not do well in school. This is when Serena started to play tennis, only at the age of five. When Serena was nine, they moved again to West Palm Beach so that she could be coached by Rick Mackey. At the end of the age of 10, Serena had a 46-3 record on the USTA Junior Tour and was ranked number one in Florida. When Serena was in ninth grade, her father took her out of Mackey's Academy and began all of her coaching at home. When she was asked in 2000 if she thought the way that her father had coached her set her back, she replied with, everybody does things different ways and ours obviously worked. Her tennis career really started up in 1999 when she won the U.S. Open, but 2002 was definitely her year. She won the U.S. Open, the Wimbledon, and the French Open. This gave Serena the world number one ranking, dethroning her sister and becoming only the second African-American woman to hold that ranking. She continued with nine more title wins and three more runner-ups until 2011. All of these wins led Serena to the Olympics. She has been to the Olympics twice. The first time was in 2000, where her and her sister Venus were not even ranked yet and still took home the gold. The second time was in 2008 in Beijing. They were seated second and took home the gold once again. But it wasn't all wins for Serena. Injuries have been a big problem in her career. She has been out for hurt thumbs, knee injuries, arm injuries, and back spasms. Some of her injuries even prevented her from final matches in which she would have gotten even more titles. Serena is also known for showing her attitude on the court by making comments at other opponents or even yelling nasty remarks at line judges. Her attitude is not the only unruly thing. Serena is known for her unusual outfits that she brings to the court, such as cat suits and trench coats. She took her love for clothes and in 2004 launched her own clothing line called Andy's. Then in 2009, Nine launched her own handbag company called Signature Statement. Serena loves to watch TV, so when she gets an offer to be on a show, she does not hesitate. Some shows she has been on are Law and Order, Pumped, My Wife and Kids, and even Voicing on The Simpsons. Serena also loves to do charity work. In 2008, she helped fund the construction of the Serena Williams Secondary School in Matuni, Kenya. She helped many other organizations, including breast cancer, which she has even won awards for her awareness for it. Serena even gave up the final day of preparation for, her, uh, for the Australian Open so that she could donate her time to Haiti. All in all, Serena Williams has been, had her ups and downs, but her ups have trumped her downs by far. Serena represents what everybody should strive for, being the best at what you love, representing your country, and helping others when they are in need. She shows that you do not need to come for much to be great. All you need is the support behind you from those you love, she said herself that family is forever and tennis is just a game.